What are the signs and symptoms of ALS? ALS is a disease that attacks the nerves which control muscle movement. As the disease progresses, patients lose the ability to control their muscles. This leads to weakness and eventually paralysis. However, the changes are gradual, usually taking place over several years. The symptoms can be quite subtle at first, and the disease affects everyone differently, which can make it difficult to diagnose. In some patients, the first sign of ALS is muscle weakness or a lack of motor control in the arms and legs. For example, the person may have difficulty buttoning clothes or find themselves tripping even when walking on a flat surface. For other people, the disease may first affect the muscles of the throat and tongue, making it more difficult to swallow or speak. In a few cases, the muscles that control breathing are the first to be affected, leading to shortness of breath. Muscle cramps and twitching can also be early symptoms of ALS. In rare cases, patients also experience uncontrollable bouts of laughter or crying, even though they don't really feel very happy or sad. None of these symptoms by themselves mean that a person has ALS. They could be symptoms of another illness, or they could mean nothing at all. Anyone can be clumsy or tongue-tied or out of breath at times. If someone does have ALS though, these symptoms will become progressively more noticeable and the muscle weakness will spread to other parts of the body. If you do have any of these symptoms, talk to your doctor. ALS is hard to diagnose and many other diseases must be ruled out first. Even with a diagnosis, it's recommended that you get a second opinion. If you or someone you love has been diagnosed with ALS, you can get help, get support, and get involved by contacting your local chapter of the ALS Association.